This is the Fisher Multitrol pneumatic controller. It's an example of a motion balance instrument. What we have here is a uh, flapper nozzle. The flapper is this bar right here and the nozzle is that brass piece. We also have a set of bellows to the left and to the right. And I say this is motion balance because if we look closely at that gap between the flapper and the nozzle, like all flapper nozzle instruments, it will act to keep the gap constant. It will try to keep that gap a constant value. As we apply an input pressure to the instrument, it's going to pump up this lower bellows. We're going to see the left-hand side of the lever rise up. That's going to try to bring the flapper closer to the nozzle. Remember, this instrument is doing its best to hold that gap constant. So in response, it pumps up this bellows on the right, moving the right-hand side down. This is a great example of a motion balance instrument because the motion over here is balanced by motion over here to keep that gap constant. So go ahead and apply a pressure there and we'll watch this go up on the left and down on the right. You can see, keep going, just keep aggressively applying, there we go. You can see this bar now is taking a tilt to it. The left hand side is going up, the right hand side is going down because that's what is necessary to keep that gap constant. That is a motion balance instrument. Now go ahead and vent the pressure and we'll see the, the bar straighten out. There we go. Now it returns to level. Left hand side dropped, right hand side rose back up. That's motion balance.